Welcome back to Doc's Hot Shop and Forge. So today we are going to make the brush that goes with the dustpan. Um, so I've got this piece of bolt which is the same as this but just a little bit shorter. So we'll be welding a piece onto this to make it a bit longer. Uh, which is incidentally an offcut of this one. Um, so um, once we've got that done, then we'll be breaking into something that I've not done before, which is actually making up a um, straw broom. Um, so should be interesting, should be fun. Um, pity of it is you can't find broom heads that you really need or want because they've all got plastic bristles and are a little bit awkward. Anyway, let's get things hot. Let's have some fun. Drop tong weld. So we need to make up a couple of little scarves. That one down. On top. Whack, whack, whack. This time we're going to go from the other side to try and get that other scarf to start squeezing out. Um, and of course camera cut out when I did the initial weld. solid enough that I can start to refine it. Let's get this cleaned up and then we'll start work on the brush. Okay, so what I'm thinking of doing is doing three or four rows of stitching. Probably end up doing that with wire. Um, and once I've got those done, I'll cut through up here somewhere work it onto the shank um, which I might have to drill a hole through just so I can put a little bit of something through it to help hold this okay let's find some wire to stitch this with Okay, I'm not sure how well this is going to show. But 
Uh, Okay, that wire is too thin and doesn't hold up very well. Okay, go with something a little bit stronger. I was hoping to avoid using this until I was doing the tie up around the shank, but we may just have to go with it.
Now, I'm not sure how much you guys are actually seeing and how much is in focus. It's a bit awkward, this. But what I'm doing is I'm kind of randomizing where I'm coming through. So that by the time I get back to here to join up, I'll actually have tied together all of these bundles plural times. So you can see I'm not coming out exactly where I came through the previous time. Okay, so that's that. I will say much respect to the um, Rush broom makers or the, the straw broom makers because that was a bloody hard job. Um, the stitching here was okay, that was relatively easy. It was getting this tight and secure, that was the tricky bit. Anyway, that takes us more or less to the end of this. So we've now got broom, the shovel. Poker. They're all in a similar style, so they all match each other. Now I just need to make a stand for them and decide whether I really do want a set of tongs or not. Um, I'm thinking not because it's a very small fireplace and generally it's, it's used as a slow combustion stove, so it doesn't need it. So that's what I'm going to leave off for this one. If you've enjoyed this uh, somewhat short video with very little smithing in it, um, please leave a thumbs up. Please feel free to share and uh, on social media and um, if you haven't already subscribed I hope you do subscribe now um, so get out to your shop do something you've never done before it's for certain I've never done this before um, but above all stay safe and I will catch you for the next one